I anticipated being scared and seeing, you know, crazy things that you read about and um, kind of a monotonous daily routine is what I expected, that you would just go see the patients, give them medications and leave was the opposite, that <clears throat> you can treat psychiatric diseases more effectively by treating the whole person instead of just the diagnosis. Um, and that incorporating mindfulness is actually something that's more helpful than even just medications alone. And that people with these diagnoses, they aren't, they aren't crazy. You know, you don't see crazy things. They're normal people with lives, just like all of us. And they, we all want the same thing, and that's just to live a happy, healthy life. Yeah, so at Seclair, one of the things that they do say is you don't come in and identify yourself as anxiety or depression or introduce yourself as that. That everyone has different components that all connect to create what they're experiencing. It's not just anxiety in isolation. And Seclair talks to you, you have counseling, you have different groups to attend that can kind of help you connect to things maybe from your past that are affecting you now um, and prepare you with skills that you can better handle situations in the future. Skills, yeah. DBT, Dialectical Behavioral Therapy, uh, teaches patients here how to deal with the stress that we all have to deal with in our lives um, and that coming here finding out that some people aren't necessarily equipped with the same skills that other people have and that's not a bad thing but they can be taught you know you're not born with all the skills you'll have for the rest of your life you can learn them um just being aware of different treatment options is something that i will take with me forever um and listening in order to really care for someone and be compassionate um, you have to listen to what's going on with them and take in the whole picture and know that different factors are always going to be affecting what you're hearing in that patient who's sitting across from you. Um, come in with an open mind. Don't be someone who thinks, oh, this is weird or this isn't going to help because the people you see here being treated are probably some of the most healthy people you'll see out on your other clinical sites. Um, so come in with an open mind, come in prepared to have some free time and come in also prepared to get some yoga going on, some drumming, just, yeah, open-minded would be my biggest tip that you'll be learning things that your textbooks will have never mentioned.